Money, lesson four, counting dimes and nickels. Today we are learning how to count dimes and nickels to find the total value. Here's what a dime looks like. Here's the front and the back, also known as the heads and the tails. And here is a nickel, the front of the nickel and the back of the nickel. A dime is worth 10 cents. This is one way to write 10 cents with the cent symbol. And this is another way to write 10 cents with the dollar symbol. See, this says that there's zero dollars, and then there's a decimal point, 10 cents. Counting dimes is the same as counting by tens. Here we have nine dimes. Let's count by tens to find the total value. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. So the total value of nine dimes is 90 cents. Let's count by tens using this hundreds chart. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. A nickel is worth five cents. You see the front of the nickel has Thomas Jefferson on the front and on the back is his house Monticello. This is one way to write five cents with the cent symbol and this is one way to write five cents with the dollar symbol. See, this says there are zero dollars and five cents. Counting nickels is the same as counting by fives. Let's count these nine nickels to find the total value. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. Nine nickels is worth 45 cents. Let's count by fives using this hundreds chart. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Notice that when we count by fives, the number is going to have a pattern. It's going to end with a five and then a zero, and then a five and then a zero, back and forth, back and forth. Can you help me solve a couple of problems? What is the total value of the coins? Here we have one dime and one nickel. Hmm, I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of lost. Well, there are a few different ways we can find the total value. We can add to find the total, 10 plus five. Okay, we know that we add our ones place first. So zero plus five is five. Then we add our tens, one plus zero is one. So 10 plus five is 15. So this equals 15 cents. We can count on to find the total. 10 plus five is 15. First we count by tens, then we count by fives and we find that the total is 15 cents. We can use a hundreds chart to help us find the total of the coins also. Here I'm gonna bring the dime over to the 10 because it's worth 10 cents. And now I'm gonna bring the nickel over and you can count one, two, three, four, five spaces. So the nickel is gonna be right there and it's gonna be a total of 15 cents. See, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 15 cents. What is the total value of the coins? Here we have a dime, dime, nickel, nickel, nickel. Okay, that means we have 10 plus 10 plus five plus five plus five. Here, I've lined it up for you. We can start, start, start on the right by adding our ones. And we know that five plus five plus five is 15. But I can't write 15 in the ones place, can I? So I'm gonna put the five on the bottom and I'm gonna carry the one 10 to the top. 
then 1 plus 1 plus 1 equals 3. So the total value of these coins is 35. You can also use another strategy to add. Here I know that 10 plus 10 is 20, and I know that 5 plus 5 is 10, and I can easily add 20 plus 10 is 30, and then I just need to add 5 more. So 30 plus 5 is 35. So the value of these coins is 35 cents. We can also count on. First, I'm going to count by tens. 10, 20, and now I'm going to switch and count by fives. If you forget how to count by fives, you can start from the beginning. You can think to yourself, okay, 5, 10, 15, 20. What would come next? 25, 30, 35. So our total value is 35 cents. Let's try using the hundreds chart. 10, 20, 25, 30, 35. The total is 35 cents. Remember the nickels zigzag back and forth from landing on a five and then a zero and then a five and then a zero? So we put our two dimes here and then back and forth, back and forth. Let's practice counting on. Okay, first we're gonna count by tens and then when we get to the nickel, we're gonna switch and count by fives, okay? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, Oh, now I gotta stop and I have to switch. And I have to think about counting by fives. How do we count by fives? What would come next after 50? Um, 55, 60, 65. So the total value of these coins is 65 cents. You can also think to yourself that you can combine two nickels to make 10 cents, right? So we could have went 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 plus 5 would be 65 cents. Oh my goodness, let's count on to find the total value. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Okay, now I'm going to switch and count by fives. 65, 70, 75, 80. So the total value of these coins is 80 cents. Let's find out the total value of these coins. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, plus five, 95. The total value is 95 cents. Okay, one more time. 10, 20, oh, now we're switching to nickels. So now I need to count by fives. 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 60 cents is the total value. Now you try. In this boom card deck, there are 20 cards for you and you're going to do the same thing. You're going to count on to find the total value. And don't worry, if you mess up and you make a counting error, it will let you know right where your error was so you can try again. Good luck and have a lot of fun.